All right, so I'm going to walk you guys through how to submit that Elements of Art um, scavenger hunt. So what we're going to do is scroll down to your learning modules. And then you're going to scroll down to week two on Thursday. Click the Elements of Art Learning or er, Scavenger Hunt document. You can tell it's a document by this DOCX, that means docs, or uh, Word doc. You're going to click the little blue link and download it to your computer. It should come up right down here in the left side of your screen. You're going to click it, and it'll open up like this. Um, so I can't type anything right now on it. So I need to click enable editing right up here at the top. And then I'll be able to type whatever I want. So the first thing I need to do is if I am working in a team, this is really important. Um, if you're working by yourself, I still would like you to put your name up at the top. So, um, how can I do that, right? If I just click it, it's not opening. Um, what you need to do is double click it. So click it twice really quickly, and then it will pop open. So if I'm working in a group, I want all of my group members to get points for this assignment. So I'm going to type all of their names, including my own, so that I know what I'm grading when I go back to look at your guys' work. So... And then I can get rid of part of this line so that it's not so spaced out everywhere. Okay. Um, so I have all three of my team members in there, including myself. I put their first and last name. Um, what period am I in? I'll just go with second. Um, and the dates, the date today is 9-13-20. So there's my dates. There's my period. My names are up there. Okay, so now to close out of my header, I can either hit this button up here that says close header and footer, or I can just double click in the document. So I'm going to upload my pictures to the Word document. So I'm going to click on the spot that I want the picture to be in. Go to inserts. Go to pictures from this device. And I'm going to find them in my computer. Okay, so I can't see what pictures I have here, right? So how do I know what I'm uploading? Well, if you go to this button right here, click the um, arrow here, and you'll be able to see the icons. That's how you see what pictures you have up. So for line, let's see, I was going to use this one. So I'm going to go ahead and insert that. And whoa, it just like made my whole screen all crazy looking, right? That's because this picture is really big. So to um, shrink it down a little bit, I'm going to use my arrow up here. You can use whichever arrows you want, um, but if you use the ones in the corners, then it keeps the original size of the picture. So it doesn't um, smush or elongate your picture. So I'm going to use my arrow and drag it down. Keep dragging it. Okay, so there is one that I have in my document. So now I'm going to insert the next one.
All right. So I have all of my pictures uploaded. Um, and now I'm not done yet with this assignment. I have questions on the left side that I still need to answer. So um, for line, I'm going to look at my picture here. Um, my lines are going up and down, right? So um, my lines are going to be vertical. So I'm just going to type that in. Um, if they were going side to side, they'd be horizontal. If I had them going across the picture plan, um, they would be going diagonal. If they were squiggly lines, they would be organic. So now I'm going to go down to my shape. Is my shape geometric or organic? Well, um, if I cut it in half, it wouldn't be the same on both sides. So that means it's organic. Now my color, um, is it warm, cool, or neutral? This is what I had for my color picture. Um, it's green, so I'm going to say that it is a warm color. Now my value. Um, my value is going to be this uh, column of, or part of the wall that's right in the middle of my picture. Um, in comparison to this wall, the ceiling, um, this back wall over here, the floor over here, it's lighter. So I'm going to put that it is a light value. Oops. All right, so texture. Um, this is my picture for texture down here. Um, is it real or implied? So if I touched my countertop right here, um, it's smooth, but I can see that there are a lot of um, shades and colors going on here. So um, it was supposed to look like it's textured, but it's not. So that means it is implied. So for my space, um, I have positive or negative that I can pick from, and then for mid or background. So um, I have this uh, piece of wall art here, and then I have my background um, here. So my background is going to be my negative space, and my wall art is going to be my positive space. So I'm going to put positive is the wall art, negative is the wall. And I'm going to add that my background is the wall as well. And my foreground is the wall art. I didn't have any mid ground in this picture, um, but I did have my foreground and my background. All right, so my last one is form. Is it geometric or organic? So if I cut this form in half, it would be the same on both sides. So I'm going to say that this form is geometric. All right, so now what I'm gonna do is I'm going to make sure that everything has been answered. All my pictures are uploaded. It looks good. Um, I have my names at the top with um, the dates right here. Um, and then I'm going to click on File. Click Save As. I'm going to go to Browse. And we're going to find the folder that I want to put it in. All right, so now when I go back to my um, modules, I should be able to click on modules, go down to Thursday, click on the elements of art scavenger hunt submit here, and then click on submit assignments, choose my file, and
click open. It's going to pop up right here that I have down or uploaded a file and then I'm going to click submit. So um, I can't submit it because I'm a teacher, but um, you guys should be able to submit it just fine. Um, that should be all for my instructions on this. If you guys have more questions on how to do it, um, give me an email. Uh, but otherwise, um, you guys should be good to go to resubmit. Um, if you're not happy with your grade, please resubmit it. I will regrade it. Um, and if you are good with what you got, then you are good to go. So I'm going to end my recording here.